Hey guys, Dr. Sharunya and welcome to Neat Buddy MCQs, sister channel of our main channel Neat Buddy and here I am providing you with MCQ on daily basis for your practice before the upcoming Neat exam. We have already finished with class 11, class 12 chapter wise and right now we are doing unit wise revision and the unit that I am going to provide you MCQs from today is on your screens. Guys, if you are finding the videos helpful, do share our videos and if you are new out there, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Without wasting much time, let's get started. Question number one, gills are not a respiratory organ in option A, mollusks, option B, fishes, option C, reptiles or option D, aquatic arthropods. Gills are not a respiratory organ in. The correct answer is option C, that is reptiles. In reptiles, the respiratory organ is lungs, not gills. Question 2. Third molar appears by the age of option A. 21 years, option B. 22 years, option C. 25 years or option D. 19 years. Third molar appears by the age of. The correct answer is option A. 21 years. This is an important data which is often utilized by forensic experts to find out the age of the criminals that come to them. Question 4. GFR that is glomerular filtration rate in a healthy individual is 125 ml per minute 125 ml per hour, 125 ml per second or 125 ml per day. GFR in a healthy individual is? The correct answer is option A that is 125 ml per minute. Question 5. Which of the following is incorrect about the wall of thoracic chamber? Of the four statements, one is incorrect about the wall of thoracic chamber. Option A. Dorsally made by sternum. Option B. Ventrally made by sternum. Option C. Laterally made by ribs. Option D. Lower side by diaphragm. So these are the walls of thoracic chamber. You have to tell which one is incorrect. The answer is option A. Dorsally made by sternum. It's incorrect. Dorsally, the thoracic chamber is made by vertebral column. Question 6. Which of the following is not granulocyte? Eosinophil, neutrophil, monocytes, basophil. Which of the following is not a granulocyte? The correct answer is option C. Monocyte is not a granulocyte. Question 7. What is the source of atrial natriuretic factor? ANF. Kidney pituitary, heart or adrenals. Source of atrial natriuretic factor. The correct answer is option C that is heart. Question 8. Antigen found on the surface of RBC in a person with blood group O is A, B, both A and B or nil. The correct answer is option D that is the antigen found on the surface of RBC is nil. Neither A nor B is found. Hence, they act as universal donors. However, they contain both the antibodies in their plasma. So, since both the antibodies, that is anti-A as well as anti-B is present, they cannot receive blood from any other blood group other than O itself. So, they act as universal donor. However, they can receive blood only from blood group O. On the same basis, AB blood group acts as a universal recipient because it contains both antigen A and B, but the plasma doesn't contain any antibody. So neither anti-A nor anti-B is present. So AB acts as universal recipient receiving blood from all the blood groups and O acts as a universal donor and can donate blood to all blood groups. Question 9. Erythroblastosis fetalis occurs when mother is Rh positive, child is Rh negative, mother is Rh negative, child is Rh positive, mother is 
ए ब्लड ग्रुप एंड चाइल्ड इज ओ और मदर इज ओ ब्लड ग्रुप चाइल्ड इज ए एरिथ्रोब्लास्टोसिस फिटालिस अकर्स वेन द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी दैट इज मदर इज आर एच नेगेटिव एंड चाइल्ड इज आर एच पॉजिटिव ड्यूरिंग द फर्स्ट डिलीवरी देर इज नो कॉम्प्लिकेशन हाउ एवर एट द टाइम ऑफ डिलीवरी सम ब्लड ऑफ द चाइल्ड गेट्स एक्सपोज टू द मटर्नल ब्लड एट द टाइम द आर एच पॉजिटिव कंटेन्स आर एच एंटीजेंस द एंटीजेंस ऑफ द चाइल्ड गेट्स इन कॉन्टैक्ट विद द ब्लड ऑफ द मदर एंड मदर स्टार्ट डेवलपिंग एंटीबॉडीज अगेंस्ट दीज एंटीजेंस ड्यूरिंग द सेकेंड प्रेगनेंसी Now this antibodies has the tendency to cross the placenta and reach into reach into the child's blood. Now the child's blood in the second pregnancy, these antibodies are going to destroy the child's RBC, resulting in severe anemia, and that is what called as erythroblastosis fetalis, in which the mother's antibody against Rh antigen is destroying child's RBC. and it is not seen in first pregnancy seen only in second pregnancy question 10 which of the following gets absorbed in stomach option a amino acid option b alcohol option c fructose or option d fatty acid which of the following gets absorbed in stomach the correct answer is option b that is alcohol gets absorbed in stomach Question number eleven: What will happen to oxygen dissociation curve if the carbon dioxide concentration is increased in blood? Option A: No effect. Option B: Oscillation will occur. Option C: Shift to left. Option D: Shift to right. What will happen to oxygen dissociation curve if the carbon dioxide concentration is increased in blood? The correct answer is option D: The curve will shift to right. Question number twelve: Broca's area in human brain controls interpretation of images, interpretation of sentences, movement of vocal cord, movement of respiratory muscle. Broca's area in brain controls. The correct answer is option C. That is movement of vocal cord. Broca's area of brain is involved in speaking. Question number thirteen. The bones of the mammals contain Hirschian canals, which are connected by transverse canals known as human bones. Or the bones of the mammal contain system of canals known as Hirschian canals. Now, Hirschian canals are connected to each other by transverse canals. So, what are these transverse canals known? Option A, Bidder's canal. Option B, Inguinal canal. Option C, Volkmann canal. Or option D, semicircular canal. Correct answer is option C. That is Volkmann canal. Question number fourteen. Oxytocin is synthesized in pituitary, hypothalamus, ovary, placenta. Oxytocin is synthesized in. Correct answer is option B. Hypothalamus and it is released by posterior pituitary. So those are the MCQs for today. I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Don't forget to share your score down in the comment section. And tomorrow we'll be covering MCQs from the next unit of NCERT Biology. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Till then, all the best and keep working hard. If you're finding the videos and the series helpful, don't forget to share it. And if you're new out there, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye.